Joke of the week. Joke of the week. Joke of the week. So as all of you know, uh, at least my friends, uh, I've had a lot of jobs in my life. I was a waiter. I've done. <laughs> I was a clown handing out balloons as a promotion. I've done a lot of things. One thing I did that I'm very proud of is for almost two months in college, I was a caddy. And um, mostly it was, you know, bankers and, you know, stockbrokers and businessmen. But every now and then you get a celebrity who would come through. And um, if they didn't have a caddy, they would assign one of us. So one day I actually got to caddy for these two guys. Um, their names were Moses and Jesus. Yeah. Um, nice guys. Uh, <clears throat> and they were uh, a lot of fun to be around. Anyway, 10th hole comes up. And I, seriously, I was a caddy, and you'll know because my golf terminology is spot on. We're on the 10th hole, and there's this wicked water hazard. The whole entire fairway is actually like U-shaped. It's a joke. It's an impossible swing. So I pull out the 20... Six iron, which is it's a it's a heavy club, but um, with Jesus, all things are possible. And I hand it to Jesus, and he hands it back. He goes, "Give me the five wood." I'm like, "The five wood?" He goes, "You know what? Make it the five and a half wood." I'm like, "Okay, that's that's not a club, but being Jesus, I looked in the bag. I'll be damned. There it is." And at the point, I would be damned, because you don't really question Jesus, but I did. I did. That was my mistake. So I hand him the five and a half wood, and he uh, gets ready to tee off, and he's going to shoot it straight over the water hazard, right over to the hole. Moses looks at him, he says, you can't make that shot. And Jesus looks at me, and I just, you know, I kind of shake my head and look at the ground, because, you know, it's Jesus. What am I supposed to do? So, Moses says, you can't make that shot. Jesus says, of course I can. I saw Tiger Woods do it. So he tees up, takes a wicked swing, ball goes slicing like crazy, splash, straight in the water. Moses is like, I'll grab that for you. We'll give you a mulligan. Which is weird, because neither Jesus nor Moses were Irish, so I don't know how they knew about that. Moses parts the water, walks out, grabs the ball, brings it back, throws it on the green. Jesus puts it back on the tee. I hand him the 26 iron. Jesus is like, nope. Nope, five and a half wood. Moses is like, you can't make that shot. He goes, no. I saw Tiger Woods do it. I can make the shot. Takes a swing. Ball goes curving, slicing, wicked, right back in the water, splash. Well, by this point, people are backing up behind us. You know, we've got... Uh, the guy who played Screech is like starting to bitch at us because we're taking too long. We haven't even teed off properly. And uh, Moses goes, I'll go get your ball. Jesus is like, you know what? Fuck you, old man. I'll get it myself. At this point, I've got Screech and some stripper who clearly hasn't slept in a day behind us getting really upset. Jesus walks out on the water as he is wont to do, reaches down, grabs his ball. At this point, Screech is like, who the hell does that guy think he is? Jesus Christ? And Moses looks at him with his beautiful flowing beard and says, no, he thinks he's Tiger Woods. And then he puts it back on the green and uh, says, uh, you know, I'm 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 gonna pass on this one. Puts the ball in his the his pocket, which is crazy because I didn't know robes had pockets. But again, with the Lord, all things are possible. And he says, "Put me down for three. And uh, Moses did because he's a sporting fuck. You know, he's a he's a, he's still alive, by the way. I know he was like hundreds of years old in the Bible, but now he's thousands and hundreds. I don't know what the math works out to, but good guy. Good guy. Terrible tipper. Jesus too. Terrible tipper. And I'm not saying that because they're Jews. Uh, I'm, I'm sure... I'm sure they would have tipped just as badly if they were 
imaginary presbyluthrans. So, anyway, that's one of the many jobs I had in college. <clears throat> I don't know why the segment's called jokes. It's, it's mostly true stories. Yeah, yeah, true stories.